Hey guys, Steve Good here with the Scroll Saw Workshop. Had a reader send me an email the other day asking me about these scroll saw sanders and uh, if I thought they were useful. And uh, so I thought I'd do a real quick little video here talking about them. These little sanding strips take the place of your scroll saw blade in your scroll saw. Uh, they attach into the upper and lower chucks just like a standard flat scroll saw blade does. The sanding strips I'm using here are from Olsen and they're an aluminum oxide sandpaper with a cloth backing. Uh, very durable, they last a long time. Uh, the pack I purchased off of Amazon comes in a set of four uh, one quarter inch wide strips and they are 120, 180, 220, and 320 grit sandpaper. I'll be honest that I don't actually use these sanding strips in my scroll saw. I have so many other sanding options in my workshop uh, that I just don't need these. If you don't have uh, many sanding options in your scroll saw workshop or you know maybe you're uh, using your scroll saw in your kitchen and, and you really don't have a shop at all, then these might come in pretty handy. You can use these on interior cuts, but just keep in mind that the head of these sanding strips is pretty large and you've got to be able to get it through the hole in your interior cut to do interior sand. Uh, the pack I purchased from Amazon cost $10.95 and I do have the Amazon Prime so I think the shipping was free. I'm not certain if the shipping is free if you don't have the Prime account. In conclusion, I guess I would say that if you don't have any other options available to you in your workshop, uh, then I could recommend these. They do work pretty well. Uh, they're fine for uh, light sanding, knocking the fuzzies off the back of a scroll saw project, maybe rounding over uh, the corner or um, uh, rounding over the edge of your board. Um, they're going to be slow, but they do work. Uh, the good news is they last a long time. Uh, you can use the uh, sandpaper cleaner uh, to clean them off and uh, they stay pretty fresh and good. So if you don't have any other options, you might want to uh, pick some of these up and give them a try. I'm Steve Good. Thanks for being here with me at the Scroll Saw Workshop. We'll catch you next time.